I'm Paul Alger. I sing, play the guitar, write, write tunes. As I get played guitar, jamming good with weird and gear and the spiders from Mars. So, uh, how did you end up playing in the spiders on Mars? Um, I've been doing a gig, uh, playing, playing some of my own songs, um, accompanied by the um, the mighty Sparrowhawks. He was playing percussion. I was playing guitar, singing my tunes. Um, playing up the Lebowskis uh, up the West End, and Jimmy, the drummer, was in, and they were looking for a replacement singer. So the previous singer, Sean, he approached me. Billy in the in the get in, in the band, the acoustic guitarist, is a tailor to trade, and. Uh, and as soon as I joined the band, I was given an outfit. It was a bit strange. Someone else had worn it first. I felt a little bit sort of like I was filling someone else's shoes. And, Literally. Uh, <laughs> it didn't. It didn't really fit me as well as it might. It wasn't made for me. He was tall and thin. <laughs> and um, I'm, I'm a bit not quite as tall, and uh, and uh, athletic. Let's say and uh, yeah, uh, but using 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 out use of the outfits is just is fantastic. Uh, I've, I've always jumped around when I when I when I've been singing in bands in the past. If I'm not playing the guitar, I jump around and I do pretty much, apart from the odd Bowie yes, but bow, Bowie move, I pretty much do what I've always done because it's very theatrical anyway. I was always like that. So uh, so joining the band just seems it just seems quite a natural thing to do. To be David Bowie. What's your favourite David Bowie song for to perform live and why? Well, yeah, I'd just say. Well, you know, I must say, it's, it's always got to be. It's always got to be Queen Bitch live because it's just you can really ham it up. You can really <laughs> let go on that one. The lyrics are fantastic, you know. You just you just visualise these uh, these queens bouncing around New York, you know, swinging their swinging their shoulders. Also, however, um, Young Americans because it's such a cool tune. It's great to sing, and it, yeah, it really pushes the. You know, I really listen to that tune. Uh, before we did it. Others, uh, I've listened to them because I, I kind of know them and I've topped up on bits and I maybe studied the song a little to catch more of the mannerisms, to get the timings right, which is, you know, really defines a song like these. But, uh, uh, but that one I really had to listen to. It was, it was, it was it's really complex. It changes the, the tone and the delivery of, of, uh, of, of, the, of, the, of, the, of the words changes twice in each line. Often it's a, mm. it's an incredible tune, uh, so I love seeing that. It's really energetic, and I'm absolutely knackered at the end of it. Uh, it's a, a full workout. You know, I'll give you television. I'll give you eyes of blue. I'll give you a man who wants to rule the world. Do you enjoy uh, playing live? It's it's. It's almost, I enjoy it so much that I'm not there. That's, that's what it's like. I, I'm, I, I'm so full of adrenaline and endorphins that I could be anywhere. I literally could be a spider on Mars when, do, when doing the Bowie stuff because it's so amazing to sing. The, the use of the range, you know, it's, it's the, you know, the, the, the actual vo you know, the, ro the vocal range that's required to sing it affects every part of the body because you're singing from the lowest notes and you, you, know, you can feel it to your toes and, and, uh, and and you can feel it leaving the top of your head. It fills the whole body. It's amazing, an amazing experience. And the liveliness, the response from the people, is is enough just to. It's, I, you know, I forget that I'm there. Oh, well, certainly during the gig as well. I, I, what I love to do is jump out and, and actually, um, in, in some of the venues that we've you know that we played, it's it's, it's easy enough to do that because there's, yeah. Uh, there's time to go around a good few people, um, um, but, but actually physically going around and, and, and jumping around the audience is is, uh, is the best thing. Um, get lots of hugs. A lot of fun. Lots of hugs. <laughs> uh, there's there's a, 
is that a raw energy is a raw energy that the band has uh, uh, and I mean that in a, in a, it's not going to be refined in some ways but when it, when it all comes together because everything isn't I guess totally uniform in a in a in a military fashion in a musical in a military fashion it sounds really big and fat and wide um, and uh, and everyone's really into the songs like the, the, the band the drummer Jimmy brother, Billy, the acoustic guitarist and Fraser, they just love, they're just total, total Bowie nuts. Um, um, and uh, Fraser gives a fantastic performance. He's, I, lo I love playing alongside Fraser, you know, it's just, you know, rocking out shoulder to shoulder in that rock, sort of, rock, rock fashion. Um, and, uh, and I give it my all. I give it absolutely everything. <laughs> I think I'm trying to kill myself when I do a gig. <laughs> that yeah. it's, not that, no, it's not that I try, it just happens. It just switches on, and then before I know it's the end of the gig, and I'm like, oh, what have I just done to myself? It's really, you know, really mm. full-on workout, but great fun. And, 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 I, and I, get, I have more energy doing that than I have when I'm doing anything else. It, it just fills me with a, a massive charge of energy. So, yeah, it's good fun. I like it. Oh, the television man is crazy. He's saying we're juvenile, the liquid rain.